say that. Just a bit sensitive. Watch that. You wanted a second bite. Don't even lie. Yeah, you well, wanted I, a second bite. I had a bite and she screamed at me. So that kind of took the shine off it, to be honest. People are going to see how much butter I really have on my bread and it's actually... Also, you're eating the whole loaf that you haven't even cut it yet. It's just wasted energy. Anyway, guys, welcome back to my lovely YouTube channel. Excuse me eating literally a loaf of bread. God, I'm so hungry and it tastes so good that... Do you know what? I'm making it work. We have a huge, well it's not even an announcement, I've basically just made a last minute decision and decided to do a pre-order for Swim Society, woo woo woo, the girls are so excited about it as well. <laughs> <laughs> We've decided to do a pre-order, I say we, I've decided you. to do a pre-order for Swim because I'm just worried that people are going to be disappointed that they don't get their swim because we haven't ordered as many quantities as like a normal fast fashion brand just because it's sustainable it's more expensive to produce we went away we went to the Maldives and so many people messaged saying I can't wait to buy it and I think we were a bit overwhelmed with how much interest we did have and because of Covid you know we weren't sure if people were able to go away we've really limited um, our quantities obviously as well because we are sustainable we have kept the orders to like a minimum purely because we don't want any waste um, again to try and be more sustainable so I thought to combat that if we did a pre-order first and foremost you guys can put your orders in we can see how many of you are loving the bikinis which is every single one of you watching this um, but also it's an indicator for us for our next drop how many quantities we need to order so that e either you know we need to order more which I think we will um, or less but yeah so essentially there's there's loads of misconceptions with pre-orders I feel like people get confused but when you pre-order what happens is you make the order <laughs> and we will give you an estimated delivery time or an estimated delivery window um, which will be in January so we've decided to do the pre-order on Sunday <laughs> <laughs> So we have decided to do the pre-order on Sunday, um, which is in two days. I'm so excited. And basically what it will mean is that um, we're going to do a limited, I was about to say limited edition. That's not what it is, is it? Limited it's time limited period. time period. Time period, that's the one. So we're doing a limited time period. It's going to be 48 hours. So you have two days to get your swimwear. One of the main reasons for that is because we do have such minimum order quantities that I do... I do envisage that we will sell out um, and I just want people to be satisfied and I just want to, you know, be able to cater for people's wants and needs for bikinis and swimwear and sustainability, okay? Um, so yeah, anything else you need to say? Um, yeah, lots more. Okay. Um, <laughs> yes, all the things. You should, See, this is why you know, should be sat in the video. Well, I'm not going to be sat in the video. Just come sit. Oh, come on, in you come. Um, so we've just got Laura in today. Um, again, after popular request. <coughs> Not so popular. Laura, tell us why we're pre-ordering. This is why I had to interrupt her so that I can say the right thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we are going to put a pre-order live for 48 hours. Um, that just means that you guys can get your hands on the swimwear, but we obviously will be doing a proper launch. So basically we had so many messages while we were in the Maldives, especially due to like particular styles. <laughs> pre-order basically we had so many messages when we we're in the Maldives so many of you saying you're going away you've already got things booked for next year obviously we're all hoping that the travel situation will be a lot better we've had a lot of good news recently so we're all feeling a lot more positive mm -hmm. so we know that you guys have already got things booked so we wanted to give you the opportunity to kind of get the swimwear that you wanted in this time frame 
Obviously we will have our actual launch, so we're not gonna put everything on pre-order. So we will have a little bit for you guys to shop when we actually launch, but this is an opportunity to secure the bag, as it were, mm -hmm. secure the suit. For your holidays or the next kini. year. Mm -hmm. If you're like me and you love a plan and a list, this is the perfect opportunity for you to get that specific swimsuit or bikini that you wanted. Like we have loads of people messaging about like certain styles that they're like, oh my God, that is perfect for my friend's wedding or my whatever it was. There were so many of you that like had a specific thing in mind. So we just thought, I mean, you just thought it's, it's quite stressful, but we just thought, why not? Also, if you're not a planner, then, you know, then you should be one, basically. <laughs> you, should, you, should, <laughs> you should try and plan ahead because it's okay. more sustainable. So disclaimer on that, because we are still working on our swimsuits, we're still making changes to some. There are some that are not going to be available. We're basically doing a bit of technic technical developments on them. <laughs> technical. <laughs> basically, with the strapless swimsuit, it's called the Layla. We want to make the hazel or, and the hazel. And um, basically, we obviously shot with all of the girls and they gave us a lot of feedback. So literally just on those two, we're going to develop it a little bit further to be that much more supportive um, because that's what the girls said that they thought it would be better that way. Yeah. So we've taken it on board and we have kind of, we're resampling it a bit further just so it can be the best it can possibly be. Um, so that one's not going to be on the pre-order, um, but all of the other ones are because they were just so perfect and amazing that we're just, we're doing the pre-order, we're going ahead. Yeah, but we didn't want to put those ones on the pre-order and then you guys get like a completely different swimsuit, even though the changes that we're making are obviously for the structure of it, it will look different. So we thought it was best to just kind of leave that one off. Exactly. Um, but obviously you can sign up to the mailing list and you'll get all the launch dates for the actual launch where it'll be available. And obviously all that information will be in the description box. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to think what else I said, sustainability. Oh, yeah. Okay, so pre-ordering is really good for sustainability because it means that we can preempt how many people are wanting the swimwear, the swimsuits, all of the different styles. And it means for the next drop, we can be a lot more accurate and not overproduce, um, obviously, so there's less waste. Mm -hmm. um, and also it just means it's better for the environment and it's just everyone's happy. Because we don't want to be overproducing stuff. Mm -hmm. And obviously because we haven't launched yet, we this is like the first, what am I trying to say? I don't know, I'm not allowed to interrupt you. Oh. <laughs> um, this is like, like the first test. This is the first test, exactly. That's, that's the word I was thinking. We about. don't have a read on what you guys like. like we don't know what styles are gonna do the best. There's gonna be some that are gonna go like astronomical, but at the moment we're like erring on the side of caution, like you say, to make sure there isn't any waste. And also for us as a small business, we kind of have to do that. Mm. But this is a great way for us to see what styles you guys like, which ones you prefer, which ones you don't prefer as well. So we can take that into, into new drops and we can just be very mindful of the quantities and the orders that we are putting out. So with that being said, obviously, I don't know how clued up you guys are on time scales of when you have to launch stuff, but probably let me not tell you, it at is, all because I wasn't. It is early. You have to get stuff down. You need to get in the early doors. So we've obviously already placed our order for this drop, which, like we said, is pretty kind of small and on the side of caution. But the pre-ordering now just enables us to look forward for future drops, and we can have a better gauge of how much we need to be ordering just to make sure we're not overproducing and that isn't a lot of waste on that. I've got something. <laughs> <laughs> I've got something. The price point is a little bit higher than if you're a regular Swim Society customer and you're looking at the price and you're thinking, holy moly, which you won't because they're not actually that expensive compared no. to a lot of other sustainable brands. Um, we are trying to stay competitive. We Let me put it into context for you. A fast fashion brand will probably make a piece of clothing for about three pounds. Ours is like 10 times more than that. And we're selling it for like a lot less than other sustainable brands because we want it to be accessible. So really, we should be selling our somewhere for a lot more, but we're not because we want to give people the option to shop sustainable and it be affordable. Um, so I just wanted to flag that and just say they are more expensive than last time. If you're watching this as a previous from Society Lava, obviously. Um, we have really kind of taken a hit with mm -hmm. um, our first drop because we 
we don't want people to miss out. We want people to love the brand as much as we do. And we understand that this is a step. Um, <clears throat> this is a this is a step up, like with regards to price, price point. point. So, I just wanted to say that that is the reason. Like, there's no other reason. It's not mm -hmm. because we've just hiked up the prices for shits and gigs. Like, it's because the materials that we're using, like we're using recycled materials. There's only like a handful of factories that actually do that now, and they're actually very expensive. Mm -hmm. um, and because we are ordering lower amounts of quantities, again, that hoists the price up as well. So it it is it does actually make our lives a lot harder being sustainable like i like i don't want to toot our own trumpet but a lot of brands it, does, yeah, of it takes them years years it takes them years to develop in, into being sustainable because it is really difficult um it's a very difficult transition mm. and a lot of people kind of tend to get some money under their belt before they go into sustainable which we did not we did not do that but <laughs> CJ, please um CJ. but I, i've just felt really, really passionately about being sustainable, like especially because we're doing a rebrand anyway. It, I think we should be looking after our environment. I think other brands should be more aware of looking after the environment. Mm -hmm. It's so, so, so important. And so, you know, I'm fine with not making as, as much money as a business, um, as long as people can understand why the prices are higher. And I hope you guys can understand that too. And yeah. you can almost change your shopping habits a little bit and, you know, be open to pre-ordering things and, mm -hmm. you know, understand how much more money goes into being sustainable as a business like we we could make a swimsuit for three pounds yeah. and we'd make a lot more money mm -hmm. and we'd probably sell a lot more because it's cheaper for you guys too um but you this is why we almost want to educate you in you know how to be sustainable and make small steps to making the world a better place mm -hmm. you know it's we're excited i wasn't excited at first i was quite scared but now i'm I excited. literally just decided today and i just dropped on the team i mean we haven't even landed in the maldives for like Landed from the Maldives for like a week, but I think Tash is gonna have a <laughs> We've got some essential oils for Tash because she's quite stressed. <laughs> Serious essential oils. Um, but yeah, we just wanted to do this video to kind of explain the reasons behind it because we know that a lot of people really appreciated us explaining everything before the trip and mm. kind of like laying that all out for you. And we want to be as transparent as possible every step of the way. So I also wanted yeah. to say that there is a team of three of us running this company, like. It's been so tough, like even doing the trip to the Maldives, being a sustainable company, putting measures in place so that we are as sustainable as we can be, offsetting our carbon emissions. You know, this is all... Just us yeah, doing that. that's what I was trying to say. I don't know why I just froze there. Um, <laughs> it's just, it's so much work to do for three people, but like we're so happy and proud to be part of the Swim Society because we, we know that we can sleep at night knowing that we're good people. Yeah. And that we're doing the right thing for the for the That's planet. That's a great line. Yeah. No, genuinely. Like, at least, I, I know that, like, we're doing our bit, like, towards mm. the planet and, like, environmentally. We are environmentally sound. And, like, I'm not saying that we're perfect at all, but, like, we're, we're starting in a good place, I feel. I mean, almost too good, actually. I feel like we're... And also, I think you guys can probably see from here, like, we're trying. And we're, trying we're really being hard. so honest about everything that we're doing. And if we, we do something wrong or we don't get it 100% right, we're all, always own up to that. Mm. And I'll I be honest, we're busting something... our balls. Yeah. We really are. That is true. I'm we tired. are busting our bloody balls. I'm really tired. To be as good and as wholesome as we can be and as transparent. And I just, I hope you guys can see that. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited to go on pre-order. Order. Um, I keep forgetting the word. Um, but I'm so, so, so excited. I'm really excited for you guys to make your orders. I'm really excited to see you guys in the swimwear. We've worked so, so hard in like developing the swimwear to be like really good quality, really good shapes and to mm. fit all shapes and sizes. Um, and yeah, get your hands on them whilst you can because they're gonna go, they actually are gonna go. Should we give them the details of how they're gonna do that? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you need to sign up. Oh yeah, go on, <laughs> explain it. Okay, so the details for the sign up to the mailing list. Obviously you can just go on swimsociety.co.uk it will be live at 7 p.m. on Sunday, the 13th of December, so two days from now. All the links will be in the description box, but the best way not to miss out, unless you set an alarm, like I probably will, is to sign up to the mailing list now and you'll get an email as soon as it's live. So and then you can go and shop. We've, we've kind of predicted our, what do you call it? When like, like our, our, our favourite products. Yeah, like our hero products. I already know which ones are going to be... Yeah, I do too. ...sell it out within minutes. We don't know, and I don't think we will be able to restock, purely because, you know, we're already making plans for drop two. Yeah. 
So, honestly, guys, I, I would love to be able to restock, but I actually don't think we're in a position no. to restock. And, like, obviously, with the limited um, quantities that we have, I'm now, like, obviously, in hindsight, I would have put in more orders. I would have made more available for you. Know. But it's so hard to know, like, especially with, like, COVID and everything. Um, but, like, that's why I'm just stressing that if you don't want to be disappointed, then I'd get your orders We're also in. not, obviously, a fast fashion brand where we're not. they can just restock within a day. Like, we have to make sure that our orders are... Months and months. Yeah, months in advance. Mm -hmm. And also, we have to kind of order all in one go. We can't just place an order for, like, ten or something. We have to be mindful of what we're doing in that sense. So it's not like your normal, oh, I'll be back in stock in a day. But, yeah, I think that's everything. Um, thanks for watching guys I hope, it, I hope it gives you more of an understanding of kind of what goes on behind the scenes even the fact that we're planting a tree for every order is that right? yeah yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're planting a tree for every order <laughs> which like we don't have to do that but we think it's the right thing to do and also, also we pay for those trees yeah we pay for those another thing coming out of my wallet so <laughs> do you know what I mean we could not be doing more so I just want you guys I know you guys will be conscious about Spending more money, but it's the right thing to do. And if I can plant a tree, you can buy it somewhere, right? Um, <laughs> but also, it, only if you like it. Don't feel forced or pressured in any way. We'd like you to. But obviously just buy it, because it's the right thing to do. But also if you don't want to, that's okay too. But then buy it for someone else, not necessarily for yourself, you know? Don't be selfish. Um, rounding that up, thanks so much for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching. Um, I'm really excited. I can't believe it's two days away. I'm scared. I'm a little bit scared. So yeah, watch this space, keep your eyes peeled on your favourite pieces, and yeah, I can't wait to share it with you. Love you guys so love much. Love you guys. Thanks for all your support, and we love you forever and ever. And if you buy some obviously. Bye. <laughs>